Hey guys, my name is Elena, I'm a graphic designer and welcome to my graphic design channel. And today I'm going to show you how you can take that flat illustrations and create that tasty 3D cheese in Adobe Illustrator in seconds. And if you're interested, then keep watching. This is size of my rock space and these are colors which I'm going to use in my tutorial and if you want to take a closer look at my design and to download an original vector file with colors and my design then go to my Patreon page, the link will be below this tutorial. And guys, if you want to start sell your designs online, for example on Adobe Stock or Shutterstock, when I invite you to meet with my new book, 50 Easy Ideas, it's book for a beginner designers who wants to start sell their designs online, as I already said. And if you want to know more about my book, you can go below that tutorial and you will find the link on my book below that tutorial. And as well, here you can find video instruction about my book and my 10,000 portfolio on Adobe Stock. Okay, guys, let's start our tutorial. Let's take light orange color in the swatches panel and pen tool and let's draw the shape of the cheese like that. the next point here and one more point here like that and close the path okay now, direct selection tool, select these two points, hold and drag the corners to round them. Uh, let's round this corner the same. And that one. Okay, now let's take ellipse tool and draw the ellipse here. Like this. Now select both shapes, go to Pathfinder, minus front. Now direct selection tool and round the corner here and here. Ok. Now copy and paste that shape, change fill to stroke, take pink color and that brush with the size 2. Ok, now we need to delete unwanted points. You need to take um, direct selection tool and select unwanted points and delete them with help of delete, delete button on your keyboard. Ok, it's ready. Uh, now let's take dark orange color and curvature tool. And draw here the ellipses. Ok. You need to create the ellipses of different sizes to create more realistic cheese shape. Like that. Ok, it's ready. Now let's create one more element. Let's take a light orange color and rectangle tool, create the rectangle here. Direct selection tool, round the corners. Now curvature tool and with the same color you need to create about 3 or 4 elements here. 
like that. And the last one. I have here three elements. You need to move them like this and move them to the center or as you like. Select all elements and go to Pathfinder Exclude. Now let's take ellipse tool, create the first ellipse here and make the copy, move here, select all shapes and go to Pathfinder minus front. Now you need to round corners. Take direct selection tool, round corners here and let's here round corners with help of a uh, smooth tool. Let's take smooth tool, select the cheese and smooth these corners. Okay, like that. And let's smooth the corners here. It will be looks uh, it will be look more unperfect but more interesting. Okay, select that shape and go to Object Expand Appearance. Okay, our shapes are ready. And now let's select this cheese and group it. It's very important. Now go to Windows, 3D and Materials and here we have our window. Select the cheese and go with me step by step, guys. It's not my first 3D tutorial. You can make this tutorial and go to my channel and create others 3D tutorial. But uh, uh, you need to go with me here step by step to create the shape I made. And if you like to play with, if you want to play with options, you of course can play with options. Uh, maybe your 3D cheese will be better than mine. Uh, so I'm going to show you my options, but you can create your own options. Uh, so let's uh, move on. And uh, I hope you know, guys, it's the new feature of Adobe Illustrator. Uh, only in the version 2022 you uh, will have that option. So if you like to, uh, if you want to create 3D uh, icons like this, you need the last version of Adobe Illustrator. And uh, you should know that it's a very heavy option. So you need pretty powerful computer to create icons like this. Okay guys, uh, the first element is ready and I hope you understand that it's uh, a raster effect. So it's not a vector, it's a raster. But if you want, for example, sell your designs on Adobe stock or Shutterstock, uh, you can sell it as a JPEG image uh, and uh, create icons like this for sell your designs online. Okay guys, and now let's move on. Let's finish our icon and as you see it's pretty fast effect. You can create a 3D icon in seconds. Uh, I think it's pretty amazing. Uh, then uh, when you can create such interesting 3D icons uh, in minute or less. Uh, 
uh, of course you need to play with options but yeah but it's pretty pretty fast and i like that new feature in adobe illustrator okay uh it's almost ready yes it's ready guys uh now uh, let's close the window and now if it's ready you need to select the icon go to object expand appearance and now the same object expand appearance now you can uh, for example make the icon bigger okay move here the cheese and now let's create the background take violet color and rectangle tool create the rectangle send it to back okay you can stay it like that or let's uh, take um, uh, radial gradient and light pink here here violet move the slider like this take gradient tool squeeze it like this and make it smaller a little rotate down Okay guys, and that's all. Our 3D cheese is ready. Hope you like my tutorial. If yes, give me a like and subscribe and see you in the next tutorials in Adobe Illustrator or in the next videos in a graphic design. Bye bye guys. Bye.